So, what now? When last we left our... What the... I'm broke, guys. Hold on. I want to imagine that that's his boss calling him to tell him, we yeah. need you at work right now. He is at work Please right now. Help. No, it's Wednesday. I think he has uh, Wednesdays off. All right. That's why he's actually dice. able to access tabletop simulator. My dice. So, um, you rescued James. That's pretty much he's it. He's mostly rescued James. My character's gonna stick nearby him and nearby him just to make sure it doesn't happen again. I'll be fine. I have science on my side. James, James had a chat with his mentor. Boss, ex-boss, mentor, take your pick. Uh, mentor. Ex-boss. Well, to them it's ex-boss, because yes. <laughs> he kind of went rogue. and I'm pretty sure corporate doesn't like that. They don't. Okay, no, they don't mind if he became. They mind that he is a. He was a slasher. They mind that he went so fucking public with it. I mean, sending in, your fucking words, monsters running won't... through town with machine guns. I mean, come on. Kind of hard to cover that shit up. They're they're an evil shat. They're they're a morally ambiguous shadow government. I was about to say the SCP Foundation, but no, it's more like Cave Johnson's fucking Aperture Science. No, no, they're a bit more Life competent than Aperture. You rip those monsters apart and see what makes them tick. Yep. But, uh, you're basically in a meeting with your new secretary, um... Abby? Is she hot? She's mildly attractive. My god, I oh, swear to god, that? I used you oh god, can that. you fix that? No, I can I fix that? Yeah, by the power power of science. Yes. I like to imagine that you, instead of making her more beautiful, you make her fucking ugly as hell. <laughs> I love how James is already like going the whole morally ambiguous mad scientist route and just like, I can fix you. We're off That's to what? a good start. I have a feeling that at the end of the game, it's effectively going to be us versus James and his boss. And a giant horde of creepy, crazy female monsters of sorts. Behold, uh, I have a giant army of monster girls. Why are they all And then it ends girls? in the most anticlimactic of ways. And then your girlfriend comes out of nowhere and just goes, Why? I'll yell back science. Science! I mean, James, if you want to go down sister. that route... I mean, there you 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 do talk to supernaturals like all the time. You totally could be capable of going down the psycho route. Just convert her to your idealisms. I have Chinese Just think food and science else matters. everywhere. I enjoy this sense. background. This would have been a nice background to have when Alex was in the party. I think we had it. This would have been time. a great background for when Al for when Alex got gunned down. Hey, look. Sorry, right, I mean, for when uh, Haskell got gunned down. There's a table on a table. Tableception. Oh my god, it's tableception. Shut up, I just said that. We're to the side of the table, to be fair. Well, if, if you, you look zoom at... out right, you can get it, you can mess with perspective such that it is on the table. Well, that's yeah. What I'm doing. Captain, my captain. Devin, stop putting tables on tables. Right, so, um, at. Fuck, I forget the name I gave. Abby. Your new secretary, Abby. What's your last name? Mm -hmm. your oh, care. I'm Resser. Dr. Resser, um, I have the paperwork for your approval of the new, uh, of the new, um, location for, of, we are, uh, locations for operations. Excellent. Hang on, give me uh, nah, I'm good, Dad. What? She, she she just called you Daddy. No, I'm sorry. Dad, my dad was asking um, if I wanted more food, and I'm good. She, no, she just okay. called him Daddy. Yeah, that would have been awkward. Yeah. Like, <laughs> your Daddy? James, where did Are your you username go? Your I image have... disappeared. 
Did someone make yes, it go away? Daddy. You lo you lost the ability to have it. Well, I guess that's what happened. Someone, I'm gonna say this while I was messing with zones. I did not click. I did not click his tag. I was stealing these tags. Ben, what'd you do? I didn't do anything yet. Um, so Dr. Resser, um, where um, we have the issues of where we are putting um, the newest, uh, the new, hmm, the new research and development laboratory. Um, site B for um, on the board affairs is already in for 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 the new um, location for business is um, planned. Um, we just need your uh, approval for the locations for Site B, for the location for Site B. All right, so is there any reason why I shouldn't think this is a good idea to put it there? Basically, it's like, you know, like, com like um, you know, the where a, a warehouse downtown that they've got a, sub a massive sub-basement out underneath. Works. Um, you know, a hospital... With um, that has you know of course the sub basements, the underground layer upon underground layer upon Under underground that. layer. Yes. So you have your options are a hospital, the creepy abandoned that. warehouse. Can I get a creepy abandoned hospital? No, that would be too cliche. It would be too obvious. No. That. No, that's why. It's so cliche, no one will think of it, because it's so obvious. And a <laughs> c closed down mental institution that they've been, um, reno that they've renovated the insides for, <laughs> but left the well, outsides to perfect. perfect. Uh, yeah, now I'm perfect. torn. So basically, that is, that is also, will you be needing, um, any loca a location for your, um, own personal experiments, or will you be doing them in the, uh, home lab, in the, uh, in Site B? I think for the moment I'll do them in Site B, but of these three locations, is it possible that I could use one of them for my own lab, or are of they course, only doctor? Oh, okay. Okay. Now the question is, do I want the insane asylum or the hospital? I go Crazy asylum. People. Asylum, because you can make out, you can you can play, you can be Outlast. <laughs> okay, so Outlast every Silent Hill game ever. Outlast. Oh, that, that's true. Oh, God, yeah. Fucking Silent Hill. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. The <laughs> hospital... The is, should... Well, the hospital is a functioning hospital owned yeah. by Chiron Group. Of course. So there is the issue with doing personal projects in the basement of a hospital, of a working hospital. Mm. Yeah, what's the problem? No one will know. They'll just hear the scream and they'll assume it's someone about and someone that's afraid of needles. I think the hospital would actually probably be more suited for the Chiron Group's lab, use lab, and the asylum since it's full of crazy people. Of course, they will completely and utterly understand that they saw horrible atrocities when they accidentally stumbled into places that they weren't supposed to stumble into. We'll just have to up their dosage a little bit tase them a few times, but you know. Tase them a few times? What are you talking about? Bring them into the experimentation. Well, that's option B. <laughs> Fix their but... crazy. Fix the crazy. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'll take the irony. I will get Outlast and Chiron can have Silent Hill. Okay, so your <laughs> site, official site B is now the hospital. Correct. And your personal laboratory is the insane asylum. The asylum. Excellent, Doctor. I will make put these um, arrangements into effect. Of course, you are aware of the man of the higher up mandate that uh, no experiments on the um, on fey creatures are allowed anymore. Yeah, I kind of can see why. Uh, too high risk. We've um, determined that they have determined it's too high risk for uh, consumer or uh, private use. Okay. Well, hopefully we'll eventually figure out a way to probably use them, or we're probably just going to continuously shovel them into a fire pit. It's more than likely the option B, but that sucks. Oh, oh, out of game. Oh, what, James? You're not going to sneak your uh, 
your changelings your changelings over to a new place to work on them. Tinker with them. Come on, James. You know you want to tinker with changelings. Well, I'm not saying it out loud. <laughs> that would be silly. Just conveniently dump them in. Just conveniently dump Fay crap into this trunk of this van of this dump truck or something, and trans. And I'll have it. I'll transport it myself to a fire pit. I like roasting marshmallows. It might make it taste better. Mm. She needs to roll. The, she needs to figure out whether that was true or not. <laughs> She's Considering good. who I am, do you really want to? No. I mean, he's Cause... not starting to indoctrinate her with his code yet. No, I'm just saying, I have the crazy idea of throwing these things at a fire and then using that fire to roast them. <laughs> so, can't. James, when are we officially saying that we're giving you the, sla the genius slasher template? <laughs> <clears throat> After my first Frankenstein monster? Okay. And uh, and you do realize that the moment you set that out into town, we're probably going to have to go kill you, right? I'm going to put a detonator in its torso. Jeez. Good. To be fair, I think James is, not, is probably going to be a little bit more subtle, considering the fact he isn't, like, being whispered to by a true fae. True. Mm. Although, his, although if his boss continues... Then he's gonna have a then he's gonna have a true fate that's whispering to his former boss, who's whispering to him. So he's gonna have even more crazy whispering into and to him. It's like telephone. <laughs> it gets more fucked up every single and ev with every single person that passes through. You want to tell your apprentice to do this evil thing? Apprentice, do this evil thing. I'm gonna do something stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that sure this entire game? So can't escape. And then you just go, be sure to put a bomb in someone's chest so they can't escape. <laughs> Cranial oh explosives, you know. Yeah, still, I'll probably put like some sort of detonator thingy where it's like, <laughs> oh, if you go past this certain limit from this location, it's going to go off and you'll become meat chunks. Unfortunate, if you, but... If you try to go on a killing spree, you will, you will become meat chunks. You'll become meat chunks before you even get the chance. I'm assuming the asylum is not near town? Yeah, the asylum's on the edge, out, like, on the outer skirts, maybe a couple miles from town. Okay, then yeah, like a mile or two, uh, like, invisible fencing of, if you pass Seven. this line, do not pass go, do not collect $200, go straight to the graveyard. Seven. Yes, then. There's something wrong with me. I'm tempted to steal more nut and more nuts and bolts from the power plants. <laughs> That's what lightning is for, genius. I'm gonna probably start by installing a friggin' lightning rod <laughs> at the top of the asylum. Go straight into a generator of some sort. Uh, hi guys, I'm back. Welcome oh, back. back. Hey I was God, busy. I'm tempted to steal another nut, so, an another bolt from your place. <laughs> Okay. Um, it's not his place anymore. It's his previous character's place. It's well, him. He doesn't care. Just you know, be aware things have consequences. Oh God! Did did did? Don't fuck did with Alex... a sil a true silver ladder shit. They will fuck your day. Oh my God! I like to imagine that what Alex did is he just said it specifically. So if I were to try to take another, I'd get a massive shock and just get sent flying back. No, no. Uh, look, look, look. Has Alex ever been so direct? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Well, shot everyone in the face. Look, well, yes. direct is a bullet straight through my skull. <laughs> I could, in fact, make it to where anybody who goes in there and touches the thing gets shot, yes. But no, I'm, it'd be more inclined to be uh, lit up and put on public notice of every single supernatural force I'm aware of. Oh, Sora, shit. I know what I need to do now before I even make my first Frankenstein monster. What? What? I need to hire an Igor. So in other your words, you're getting a retainer, aren't you? You do realize that you could just hire one of us to be your Igor. We're all pretty damn insane. Yeah, I don't know. Exactly I, I'm perhaps so am I standing out another freak slasher? Question, can a werewolf even turn into a freak slasher? No. 
There no, you go. You can't go from one supernatural archetype to another readily. It's more of a joke, honestly, Sora, but if it's possible. Yeah, yeah. It, it just needs a couple dots of retain, like a four dot retainer or something. How much is that going to cost me? Um, probably. Well, let's see if it's a three dot. Um, two. So it's. A three dot would cost you 12, so a four dot would cost you uh, 20 XP. Depending on how much we get by the end of the session, I might have that. I honestly I wanted someone that. who is competent enough to move parts into locations and to do basic menial tasks like clean the floors, make me coffee, move the thing, smack the dumbass. Smack and transport that the ass. Smack my and go and smack my secretary's ass. So your right. secretary will put your um specific. Do you have any specific specifications for your laboratory? And yes, James, you are gonna need to pay XP for this because this is totally a secret base. This is totally like a hunt. A, a, a hunter counts as a hunter base. All right. So um, if you don't have the XP for it. I have honestly 16 points spare right the now. The GM can give it and the GM can take it away. Unless you buy it with XP. Alright, let's see. Well, short of the obvious medical equipment. Size, I'm, I'm, size is going to be your major issue. A recommendation? Size is always the biggest issue, Devin. Perhaps. Perhaps security. And then you just see it, then you just find out that a werewolf just walks straight into your base. Just and walk through all your traps, set them all off, manage to come over to you unscathed, only to give you a bottle of sock and leave. That's why you <laughs> load your traps with with uh silver bullets. <laughs> hey, have you seen have you seen dumb bullshit luck? <laughs> When nothing fucking hits some, nothing you set hits anything. <laughs> Alright, so adding to the list of things that I have Secret Lab. Layer. <laughs> so, how, how much does the size of this cost? I think it's standard merit XP cost. Um... That's stuff for another time. Shit. Uh, uh, yeah, secret bases are typically meant to be split amongst party members because, as Spec demonstrated by per pretty much purchasing it all himself, it can get kind of expensive to you. Mm. Yeah, and... Upside is if Spec ever decides he wants to kill the entire party, he has a place that he can go that none of us can truly find. Alright, so for now, I guess I'll just leave secret base as a blank thingy and fill it with Sora later. Oh my... Fill it with Sora. That's a tiny fucking base. Well, you know what I mean. Food. Oh yeah, it's gotta have a mini fridge. He drops the base. Not a normal size refrigerator, no, that's for the science. I need a mini fridge for myself. <laughs> you need a mini fridge for yourself, you say as you crawl into the mini fridge to stay nice and cool. <laughs> right. Mm. Science makes me so hot. <laughs> that explains what <laughs> Tyron group just calls you up, sir. We're we're noticing a massive spike in your electricity bill. We have What's going on over there? I'm uh, keeping myself cold, sir. Did uh, you did you science? go in the fridge again? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I did not lock myself in the fridge again. <laughs> I did not lock myself in the fridge again. Do you need help getting out of the fridge? I never was in the fridge. I didn't say that. I said I was inconveniently in a place that I need probably to escape from. So yes, send for one. <laughs> Post haste. And get me a coffee. And lots and lots of hot cocoa. Kyron just responds, I'm sorry, we're too... We're, On we, second we, thought, we, just we, bring we, me my pyrokine <laughs> pyrokinetic. No, no, no. The Kyron group just goes, we've helped you with this five times this month. Bring me my just, bring me my pyrokinetic. Just where's my pyrokinetic? Just, girl? just do it on your own. And you just call up one of you just call up one of us and just go. I need you to come into my trap filled base to get me out of a fridge. 
And this is why I need a Igor. <laughs> Your Igor dies in one of the traps. That would be absolutely beautiful. I, I want to see this happen. <laughs> Fun fact, your traps are not actually lethal to you and your own party. Hmm. You basically, uh, unless you deliberately trigger them on yourselves, you can't trigger them. So in other words, we can just walk into his base, hand him stuff, and oh. then walk out. Yeah, uh, unless uh, unless he takes time to share the information with us in character, yes, we can trigger each and every trap. Because he, he has purchased this himself. Fun, isn't well. it? Okay. Oh, my! the other thing my secret base needs. Neon lights that says, totally not a secret base. No, no, you don't make it a secret base. You make wait, it public. You, you, you here, lie here. to the public about what your research is. To them, it is a cancer research place making bre great breakthroughs on the treatment of new, on new treatments of, of, of um, cancer and other infectious diseases. That way, when some supernatural threat like us decides to blow it up, it's treated as a very bad thing, and you get the cops on their side. What are, oh, what are, okay, side. here's the better question. What are cops going to do against us? Uh, shoot bullets. Get killed. Get killed and escalate things. We're, 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 we're get killed, things. escalate things, Task Force Valkyrie gets involved. Mm. Nasty things happen because those motherfuckers can fuck your day. I mentioned, by the way, that, I'm, that I am very much pragmatic evil whenever I do my secret evil base thing. Well, any which way, I have a base. It's in a place. It's going to be fun. <clears throat> There's going to be blackjacks and hookers. And it has theory. a base. And I'll probably also, hang a neon sign somewhere in it that says, totally not a secret base. Also, you made the comment that if I ever decided to kill the entire party, I had a place to hide. Sure, I got a place to hide, but because of that place to hide, I'm too fucking weak to actually kill the entire party. <laughs> uh, you might get away with a couple people. Collectively, collectively speaking, I'm probably the hardest to kill in the party because I've, I've got the most defense. I might, I oh, might no, be the I'm second totally hardest because of the amount of health and because after this session I'm gonna be, ha I'm gonna be getting claws of the ashes. I'm also least likely to particularly care if you kill the rest of the party. <laughs> anyway, Sora, uh, what's next? Hey, if you give, if you, pr if you prove that they're all corrupt assholes, I, I'm, I might do it. What's next? Um, fuck. Uh, we go to someone else. Yes, um, who want, does anyone have anything they desperately want to do? Well, um, I'm meaning to investigate something kind of core to my character. I nope. mean, you know, we've got some downtime, and somebody did kind of get me killed. And my spirit is harping harp, you know, out for vengeance and blood for the uh, one who's brought the death to so many. <laughs> yeah, you should. Oh, it's, ha it's Haskell. I'm totally Haskell. <laughs> Somehow I would believe that too. <laughs> right, so um, roll me some intelligence investigation. Okay, give me one second. I am a ho I am I am hoping you don't get anywhere with this. On side note, if you kill my character, I get to and I get to do nothing Wednesdays until Devin's next game. Unless you want to do build a vampire. <laughs> For two for two sessions. It's not going to be two sessions. It's going to be a couple months. Speaking of two sessions, I may or may not be capable of making the next couple weeks sessions. Right, because uh, I will do thing. my best to show up and be available. But selling the house and everything will be my full priority while I'm in Kansas. Yes. That makes sense. Okay, my, my sheet is opening now. Intelligence investigation. Wouldn't it be Wits investigation since I don't have initial leads? True. Yeah, Wits investigation because there are no leads right now. Okay, now I'm going to grab my six dice. I'm going to willpower this because one of these dice is not like the other. One of these dice does not belong. Mm hmm. Hey, what up, douche nuggets? Hey! Oh! 
Let's go. One, two, uh, three, I got exceptional six, success. Five. Oh, then you're actually able to uh, hack it your way into the. Uh, into, of course, Network Zero once again is your friend. Yeah. You know what? Uh, Devin, I want to buy these guys a beer. <laughs> so I'm guessing he found out, didn't he? Um, you see a blurry image. A uh, blurred image of, of, of an invisible thing, correct? A blurred image. Um, there's some... Uh, it's a grainy camera. You were invisible at the time, weren't you, Ben? Yeah. Of basically two nuts getting popped off. You did carry them away. And, you know, then suddenly, um, or... Actually, give me a percent. Give me a wits. Uh, a a wits composure. Uh, what is it? It's wits composure for uh, noticing things, isn't it? Yes. Then roll me that before I give you anything. Okay. Oh my God, your wits composure is stupidly high. Mm -hmm. Also, I spend a willpower on it because that's what I do. It, it seems like none of those changed. Oh, shit. No, they changed. Ten, 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 eight, eight. Get yeah, some love. Roll those beautiful. My... Well, my, my ghost, ghost is, is going to die. That beautiful bean footage. My ghost is crying out for vengeance. Just for record, no additional successes, but that's still one, two, three, that's still five. four, five successes. So, um, you notice the two bolts being, re the two nuts being removed, and then suddenly everything going into chaos. Okay. So, from this, you can gather that you are looking for something capable of <laughs> becoming invisible. Interac interacting with things while invisible. Yeah. The static is back. Oh, and it is boring. Hello? Better? There you are. Anyway, join us, Haskell. Join us! Yep, much better. I'm here, more or less. Okay. No more I was walking out, that was two exceptional rolls, so I better get more information that there was just this dude that was invisible. Like, maybe Network Zero has some ideas or leads as to what it could be. Um... That's them. Things that Hopefully you're... they're still alive. Um, things of note that you will notice. Um, they aren't 100% sure. There's a lot of arguments. Like, there's no way this is real. Maybe it's a vampire. Wait, vampires are invisible on camera? Uh, there are breeds of vampires. There are rumors about that kind of thing. You ever see Oh my ever... god. No, there are, actually, there are legitimately breeds of vampire that are... Uh, that basically can th th there are vampire abilities that basically allow them to become invisible my god oh, and shit. i think this happened at night too so it actually would fit no it was during the day at the time <laughs> no it was evening i thought it was yeah it was night it was night actually we fought Not all day and night until i until i decided to try to pull something stupid like that. yes So yeah, it was night. So actually, that is very possible. Sweet. So the most plausible theory is vampire. Okay. You would, um, at least that they're thinking of. I will give you a plus two. To find out further. To information. um, give me to your occult, to an intelligence occult role to uh, figure out. I swear to God, you're Spectre. Saying, I need. You're saying I'm most likely going to need a third fucking um. Exceptional. Wait. Well, no, uh, but you have, have bonuses. I have willpower there. to burn, so yeah, and you have plus two dice from your um. And this is the cult mm. Mm. I am going to die. Gonna, your character is so gonna get me killed. <laughs> Make sure you call me before you actually die, so I can, you know. One, the last, no exceptional two. this time. 
Yeah, just My luck two. had to run out eventually. Um, there might be some magical items, but from everything you can gather, a vampire is probably the most plausible. Um, it would take you some time to figure out, like, if there are any specific magic items. Changelings have spells that make them kind of invisible. There Basically are a lot running down the list, there's vampires that turn invisible, there's changelings that turn invisible, there's spells that turn you invisible, and there's, there's items stuff that, that can invisible. turn you invisible. Yeah. Very fortunately, I know... <laughs> That's a laundry list of have... shit to go through, goddamn. Very fortunate, I have a good place to start, because there are, like... Two or three people I know quite close that can go invisible that might have leads for me. <laughs> so about that jacket, Van, you gonna keep it? <laughs> I what what are you talking about? I'm currently I'm currently with my sugar daddy. It's not sure I mean. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. So your slasher, your daddy. I get a call, I get a call and and, and you you Gardner just and Gar, Gardner's character calls me. I pick up and all he hears is moans, implying <laughs> I have, <laughs> implying I have a cell phone. All he hears is oh, moans God, and give God. it to me harder, Daddy. <laughs> oh God, I I thought this was a joke that you were actually banging your slime. Oh Christ, yep. Of course, Ben's putting sex in the game that didn't have sex up until now. <laughs> Why am I not surprised? Hey, the graphic of a PG-13 rating being burnt to death for an R rating. <laughs> By the way, you know what? At least it wasn't God to this time. <laughs> well, look, like I said, I don't typically do that for most games. I really swear I don't. Spectre says you do. <laughs> Anywho. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and then there were penises. Hey, Devin. I'm officially named the slasher Devin. Oh. <laughs> no. And you're grounded. Go to your room. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> So the question is, what am I doing when I'm not banging my sugar daddy? Thrown onto a stake and burnt at it? <laughs> uh, no, no, I think I'm just gonna, I'm thinking I'm just gonna hang out at the Wendy's, like, Jerome two minutes away from my house. Jerome shows up with a shock, with a gun loaded with silver and shoots the fuck out of you. If only. <laughs> if only. Okay. <laughs> hey, Leon, would you mind popping into the, um... Game room? Yeah. Okay. Yes, uh... because, uh... So, uh, yeah, you're, uh... So the werewolf is, uh, busy. If I seem like I'm not tracking for shit right now, it's because I'm, uh... Fuck. Also, um... Bef My brain cell just crapped out again. Oh. It's okay, it happens. Um... At some point after this session, do you th and before mine, do you think you can uh, get your character for my game ready? Um, I can help with that, Liam. Don't worry. Yeah. If you're, if you're still up for it, the game has become shenanigans. The game has the become game has, an orgy. The game, unfortunately, thanks to Ghana, has become an orgy. Please be a male and and please be a male and put a stop please to it. Please be the straight man. <laughs> I know that's please, hard. Please, no. oh, Leon, yeah, please, I know please. that's hard for you. <laughs> just be the straight guy. Look, just because I butt fucked the shit out of that one asshole for being a fucking douche nugget doesn't mean I'm not straight. That just means that I hate fucked his ass because he is being a fucking idiot. Didn't you say that there was uh, male love days in the army? Oh. No, it's Man Love Man Monday. Love Thursday. No, what are you talking about? It's the D Club. No, it's Man Anywho. Love Thursday. It's completely heterosexual. Now yeah, pop into the um, oh, yeah. <laughs> tabletop sim. By the way, Dev, go ahead and pass out everybody's dice with Leon's set now. Hold on, no. His wait, set is in here. Say? Here, give, give, me, give me a second. Dev, Dev, Dev. What I do? Well, you know, that's not the same set. You yes. know what I'm talking about. 
Let's... All right, I need to unlock my. I keep forgetting. You I are getting my... Alex's dice back when he isn't. When the boogeyman. That's isn't not Alex's. It. That's that was Slim's dice bag. Why did I have twenty dice? Because well, I have twenty dice because dice. unlike you guys, I routinely need that many. Anyway, so. So yeah, so but when you when you're trying to get in contact with me, Ghana, I am quite preoccupied. <laughs> you you managed to get to me for once, but you hear moans. Oh, and... daddy! Oh, dad! No, we're not doing this. God damn it! God damn it! Man. <laughs> hey, Devin, hey, you're the one that, guys, that finished that. I have a solution. <laughs> Can you guess what that solution is? Kill it with fire. Oh, napalm. Kill everything with napalm. Love and compassion. No. <laughs> This is not a napalm problem. This is a white phosphorus problem. <laughs> oh, God, no, please don't burn my down. <laughs> Look, at least I'm not burning you with the full hatred of napalm. I'm burning you with all the peace, love, and forgiveness of white <laughs> phosphorus, which cannot be extinguished as long as there is something... Reasonably burn. close to the alkali side of the periodic table. Sorry, to the halogen side of the periodic table. I guess it's a good thing. Have... I, 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 oh god, I did take you to my home. No. <laughs> that means that you're already ranged up for the uh, party strike. <laughs> I, why can't I just enjoy myself? <laughs> Besides, wait, Ben, you're in the south. Why? Just because it's love doesn't mean that it's love without me being there to make sure it's my kind of love. And compassion, no. No! No! Besides, there's only so much love the world can really take without me being there. Without you sure giving the compassion. It gets loved properly. Oh my god. Oh my god. And then I totally give you the jacket, and you get and you get killed by Ghana. <laughs> what would I use that jacket for, dude? Mine's bulletproof. Mine goes and mine makes you go invisible. Yep, Leon doesn't. Do, this character of Leon's doesn't do subtle. When has Leon's character in this game done? Oh subtle God, game? he's right. Hey. That's Holland the reason Harris. why Alex hasn't hasn't been the uh, you know the direct sort. <clears throat> anyway, so he, has Alex. Well, he has um. Anyway, so what is um, Leon. so what is Spectre doing? Absolutely nothing. Okay, Spectre Leon, once ready? again the most interesting fucking character in the game. You what? I'm gonna go ahead and get once again the most interesting since, character in the fucking uh, the, game. One of the two stealthy guys I saw doesn't know, and your character might have an idea. Ouch. Mm. Anyways, I'm making that thing, waiting for that thing to load. I was honestly playing Skullgirls because I wasn't doing anything. <laughs> in character or out of character? Both. Okay. So yeah, in character he just and so in character he's and you're saying that you were just playing Skullgirls. Yep. GG. I I got the achievement rage quit. <sighs> so what are you? What do you tell God no when he calls you asking about the facility? I think he just said it. What? Mm -hmm. Oh, he just shrugs it off like, I don't know, fuck it. Mm. Guys, I, are we... Well, oh, oh, look, let me rephrase it. I will say, I can go invisible, but I'm also not an idiot. Oh, I wasn't actually accusing you. I was actually thinking more along the lines of... You might have an in, in, ins or outs uh, or ideas as to where I can be in looking for this. Because I got this screaming monkey on my back saying, you know, go forth and find vengeance for yada yada yada. Can you go invisible? Can go invisible. Can you go invisible? Um, I personally cannot go invisible. Well, then you can't pick up power plant. 
Hey, I got a question. Yeah. I think it's mirrors, but there's one of the changeling uh, I think power it's... lines yeah. that you can go through and your dreams will let you see shit that you need to see. There's some sort of prophetic dream shit in, in changeling. I don't remember what. I think it's a contract set. I just can't remember which contract it is. It's dreams. Are you so, are you planning on doing a Muriomancy? No, what I was planning on doing was going ahead, uh, finding a couple of the members of my uh, changeling group and telling them, hey, while we're waiting on the queen and everyone else to get uh, recovered or at the very least stop bleeding all over the place, I'm going to need a couple of you guys to go ahead Take this roof, Len, and tell me what you see when you wake up. Leon, but you know as well as I do, Rooflin doesn't give you dreams when you sleep. Okay, I will proceed to find my good buddy, Knuckles, who will bludgeon them in the face until they go Why to sleep. Why don't you just have your slasher make them some drugs? <laughs> he tried that already, Rooflin. You know, he was going to roofie them. Yes. Yes. But your, your, your minion can make super drugs. No, my minion is turning over a new leaf in life, so tracking out right. the people who sabotaged his lab, and then proceeding to... Murder them? Get her, them to wait, me. wait, what do you mean by sabotage your lab? No, uh, no, that's the background and backstory of his, of, the sla of his pet slasher. That somebody yeah, sabotaged his uh, meth lab or whatever drug lab he was working Oh, with. right, okay. Yeah, which caused him to pick up all kinds of nasty burns and the police didn't properly investigate. So he's busy right now uh, figuring out who would go ahead and solder the connections on his variable resistor for the heating stove that he was using so that he can go ahead and have a very nice, civilized conversation with them. And with lots of loving... Wait, wait. So, by nice civilized conversation, uh, that what's that a euphemism for? Running him, running them over with his car. Uh, I was gonna assume skinning them alive and then dragging them along while still alive until he runs out of pavement. <laughs> Why don't you shoot him thirty-seven uh, times? Dosing their system with. Uh, Epinephrine and amphetamine to keep them from dying of shock. <laughs> You're fucked up, man. No, I um, just... Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I, so, I just live in a country where murder porn is one of the major fetishes. So... Devin, so anything interesting happens? Queen, something does interesting does happen. Um... As uh, the, the queen is apparently awake and wants to see you. Okay. Um, as, okay, I proceed to show up and first thing I say when I enter the door is... It wasn't me this time. <laughs> I know who have heard all kinds of things about uh, the guy who... My buddy's worked for my buddy used to work for and everything that's happened to his family. I am in no way, shape, or form responsible for that. That is someone entirely separate from me. <laughs> I would never take vengeance for you. I would let leave that to you. Oh, you're referring to Jerome and all that crazy shit? Yeah, I figure my character would probably have found um, James's boss. Tracked his family back about three generations, and then started with the great great grandparents, moved out to their kids, their kids, so on and so forth, just to make sure he got a good purge out of it. You're you're t you can't do time travel, motherfucker. Oh no, but you see, you go ahead, you find he basically kills basically he kills all the remaining siblings of of uh, James's former boss. Oh, wow. Uh, siblings, pretty much the entire family. <laughs> You're just siblings, gonna... cousins, second cousins, third cousins, fourth cousins. 
Anyone he may have known. He pissed off the wrong party. We'll leave it at that. Oh, no. <laughs> this is a standard... No, no, this is just oh. business, standard business procedure from Leon. He figures if he wipes out anybody that's likely to uh, do the whole vengeance thing, then, well, nobody's left to come after him. When he, when oh, so you've got him. you've gotten uh, have you got a list of all this, or have you got have you already completed this? Because that's going to need some investigation rules, brother. Well, I'm going to assume that while my slasher was off handling his own personal business, he did a quick Google search on the guy's genealogy line, and then just started tracking who had what kids. I mean, it's all readily available through most genealogy sites. What and I... then started exterminating the guy's family because, A, I'm busy off doing other shit, so while I'm doing shit, you can go ahead and start busting caps and popping skulls. Okay. Guys. I've hey, at least lot. I'm only doing the outside. I do wacky shit. I'm just trying to make the entire outside just, oh, hey. Guys. Yes. Yes. No! <laughs> My hard work! That, that, that is not what I am here, what you are here for. Although I appreciate your work ethic. At least I'm trying, at least I'm participating in the table. Okay, well, oh. I've done my bit of investigation, and... Uh, Anyways. So, uh, but that is not what you are here for. Oh. As she is, like, kind of, like, in this hospital bed, bandaged to hell. The order of... The, fa the family order needs to be restruct... has to go under restructure. I am down a right hand and a left hand. There are two positions open, and I want you to fill one. Of them. I deny any and all responsibility, and I would prefer not to be responsible for anything in the future. Considering you try to blow it up after the time? Yeah, um, anything I'm responsible for generally ends up as a large crater. He's not wrong. Your strip club has been a, hasn't become a creator yet. Yeah, the strip club. The strip yeah. club's been pretty yeah. damn, pre, been pretty damn uh, successful. You have even had a fucking werewolf strip and strip dance for people and give people lap dances. No, you see, the strip club gives me money, so the strip club does not. Wouldn't wouldn't this give you money if if what she's saying is that you're getting a promotion? A position with power and perks. Position of power, yeah, perks, and money. With those powers is, and perks... Isn't this what you initially point. wanted? But that would mean I'm responsible for them. Yeah, but if you became the boss, then you would have been responsible for the entire thing. Aren't you also responsible for your own little strip club? No, they manage to take care of themselves, and when anybody does anything stupid, usually they find themselves disappearing under everything else. <laughs> <laughs> So once again, your solution to everything is love and compassion. Yes. Love, compassion, and understanding. Oh, he got rid and of my horse! And friendship. <laughs> Peace and friendship also get used. So you're, sa <laughs> you're, you're saying no to my offer of making you my advisor or my... Knife. Advisor I can do. I, I give great advice. Most of which involves artillery, airstrikes, or excessive amounts of violence. Well then, my knight. The, well the, I she damn it. I, I'm, I was I was so hoping you'd be her knight. All right. You should just say knight because, and you should just say knight because that effectively just means leaving a wake of love and compassion. Yes. Yeah, I mean, I'll go with bishop. If if you go with knight, she'll effectively just tell you. You can, and she'll let you go loose even more than you already do. I I can go for that, and, and she'll give me more targets, more people. I yes. I can. Um, being her knight yeah, means getting rid of. Being her knight means getting rid of her and those who come who rise against her. 
which also means more targets for you to leave in a wake of flaming ground. Sorry, liquefied only... ground. No, liquefied peace. Also, it means you can only move in L's. I, I will <laughs> accept this only oh. movie in L's thing <laughs> if I am allowed... It, sorry, if I am supplied with additional um, areas which need to be pacified in the name of peace and love. So, apparently something I just discovered about the doodle to tool, those lines aren't moving three dimensions. Mm -hmm. Take a look at the, from the side. <laughs> oh my god, that's trippy. What? Oh, this dribble cool. tool is a three-dimensional tool. Yeah, that's the least thing I've been doing this whole damn time. Huh. I didn't <laughs> notice it was three-dimensional. <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, they also have three-dimensional pins you can use in real life. So you are accepting. Congratulations. Uh, what's your rank of uh, of uh? I, I had four dots. Now I have five. Five in uh, what in what the uh? Summer court. court. I think it would be. Summer court. Yep. Yeah. Oh damn. Yep. Yeah, he's summer court because uh the new yes, newbies went to court. Is someone doing what I think they're doing? <laughs> yeah. That is amazing. Lovely. Who's is that James? <laughs> Who's fucking oh. urinating into the microphone? <laughs> it can't be me because I have a desktop. I'm glued to this location. I forgot about Wait, that. What? 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 Yes, you did. Lay on. Yeah, you guys went on a bit of a field trip. <laughs> and there goes the tequila. <laughs> hey, Devin. At least, at, least it, at least it was fancier than what I brought you to. I brought you to an anthro... I, I brought you to a furry <laughs> How is this possible? I'm only doing it in tiny circles. What the fuck? Tonight's just our derp episode, isn't it? We're probably mildly okay, happen. Okay, well... I know. So who are you talking to next, Scott? Nah, it's basically, it's like... She makes the pledge... You, you make a pledge with her? Yeah, okay. Uh, or um, Leon makes a pledge with her. Basically, we'll go over the details. Basically, now you're, you're you you work more at four. It's basically hey, like get out of there, get out of there, God. <laughs> Do I have asshole? You know what? I couldn't help it. I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry. So, being a knight, does that mean I have to carry around a sword of some sort? No, any weaponry is. No. Can you just say that? I saw a sword. Nine million. No. For fuck's sake, I'm. Are, are, God damn. Are, yeah, she looks at you, pausing and goes, Are you making a reference to that rope that Leonardo DiCaprio, Romeo, and Juliet movie? Were there... No, I am making a reference to Black Lagoon, where Revy has a pair of cutlass, sorry, Fry Industry cutlass 9mm. What the fuck? They, they oh actually, my god! Because actually oh in the god. Romeo and Juliet movie they did with Leonardo DiCaprio, they took the lines directly, so when someone said, fetch my sword, they literally they pulled out like a... Gun. They pull out like a rifle that has like sword written up in embossed on the side or some shit. Or they just whip out their pistols. It's basically imagine Shakespeare spontaneously combusted into modern day eras, and that's what he had to use. But he couldn't translate anything from you know ye old and English to modern day, so it stuck ye old and English. Behold my sword. It's a 9mm thingamajig that shoots bullets of death. 
I just want to know how the oh uh, God, how the sword fight chewy. between Tybalt and Romeo went out. Uh, fist fight for the ninety percent of it. No sword. Okay. Well, I was then, actually going. I, 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 <laughs> that's cool, but I was actually thinking the insults. <laughs> just imagine you wander into that, and some people are are, are insulting each other in Shakespearean English. Bite my thumb at you? Yeah, they still do that. They even bite their own thumb. Yeah, they do. <laughs> I bite my thumb at you. <laughs> I did not. No, okay. now, now, why is my fuck the police erased, but his cock gets to stay there for like an hour and a half? Well, Sora is because fine. I was fiddling the options to make sure, because I thought that I stopped the op, turned it off, but I didn't, so, uh... Fuck the police! And then you just, and then you think you disable, and then I just write... Fuck. And you just very well, my knight. Go forth and destroy. That I can do. Why do you that have I to? Do what? Great zeal and gusto. Do you have anybody you particularly like to be um, pacified in the name of peace and I love? Want, no, I, no, I, I Leon, Leon, say, Leon, Leon. Give me a second. I kind of want her to say, Leon, is what is thy bidding, my master? Yes. What is thy bidding, master? Isn't that an Igor line? Cause that is an e that is an Igor. Meanwhile, I think God a minute in the in the ways of Star Wars. Or what is yes. thy bidding, my queen? Is also yes. an appropriate one. But you know, you know what? I would honestly love it if she said, "Kill the person who put who who, who put me in this state," and you just go, "Already done." <laughs> And anybody related to him, and anybody, and me. anybody related to him has already been murdered. Find the one responsible for this. Destroy them. Actually, no. I have somebody on the task of the of um, striking vengeance. You have dealt with his family. <sighs> I have someone ready to deal with his minions. And you, and he is. There all, is, he, however, a task for you. I'm ready. The Winter Court seeks to bring a vizier into our freehold, into this freehold. Is there is that a problem in in any way, shape, or form? Um, a, a vizier is the, 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 um, at a game. The vizier is a really fucking powerful entitlement for changelings that basically they can just buy Matt. I think they can pretty much buy every contract. All contracts are in type and basically it's either costs them two times dot or one times dot for contracts. So, basically as long as it helps the freehold. And basically, the courts, first. the courts need to. You really think I would leave out something like that? The courts need to. Uh, I just want to make sure. Take you know, take their advice into account. Wise person. And like, the vizier. Wise person. Usually, if the vizier thinks that something is not going in a way that that will benefit the freehold, they will use their substantial amounts of obtained powers to get rid of a problem. Make sure you do the shells. So, in other words, what's the problem here that needs that 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 requires us to get rid of the vizier? The win, the 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 win, the, the basically it would mean that the winter court would have basically a grab on the balls of every court, including the summer court. And the summer court, you know, the winter court, the winter court's a bunch of cowards. Basically, the whiny emo bitches believe that they've got skills. And they think that they can rise up above their place. So we are to remind them that they are the court of mourning by giving them something to mourn. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm pretty <laughs> sure I fucked up more things than you have. In, with my own bare hands, Mr. <laughs> I can only drive tanks on things. <laughs> hey. To be fair, and also she's concerned because... The Winter Court is full of assassins. They may be the Court of Mourning, but those mother... Basically, they're the, si they're the Silent Arrow. We do I don't want the Silent Arrow watching over our every move. 
especially while the queen is in the hospital. So she, so she's basically saying, I either need, and you either need to get rid of these guys, or if that's not possible, you need to get, you need to uh, make sure that they can't you need to, to get. Everybody. Basically, she wants you to get rid of the thing that will basically make it so that if she gets out of what the Winter Court views in as out of line, which is a decent chunk of what you guys do. Brave party. Brave. Basically, the, the Winter Court will have a personal weapon to destroy the Summer Court. This is bad for business. So we go ahead. We have a couple of our dreamy type people start trying to dream up his location and figure out where this individual is so that we can send them some targeted, guided intercontinental ballistic freedom. You know, Haskell, I want this done personally. I want, hey, to, Haskell? I want his head on a fucking plate. Hey, Haskell, I just realized, technically my character worked for you as he works in your uh, brothel. Mm hmm Now, out of curiosity, when you say on a plate, does it have to be in one piece, or can it be as a liquefied smear? I plate? would prefer the actual head. I want this done in such a way that there is no doubt that they are coming back. Oh, we specialize in that. <laughs> and I want to make and I want and make what's left of, and leave the body there in such a fashion that they know not to fuck with us. Oh, we can do this too. Is the wood chipper an acceptable means of um, making sure that it is spread over a proper <laughs> area? I don't care how you do it. I just want their head and Well, do whatever you want with the whoever's in front. Whoever gets in the way. I feel all warm and fuzzy and bumpy. And, and oh God, I feel like you actually you? really love and care about me. What the fuck was that, guys? I wish I knew. <laughs> I step away for a moment to look at something, and suddenly I hear someone flailing dice bag. <laughs> then you're grounded. That sounds somebody putting someone in their dice bag and just slamming it about, beating the shit out of them. <laughs> what it sounded like to me. <laughs> I'm too sober okay, for this. So, what the action? Never mind, I know exactly what happened. Where did the fucking bag go? I don't know. It's in my bag. I got it. Where's my... There we go. So you have your mission. The queen wants this vizier dead at any cost. Very, very doable. I'm just trying to figure out how to keep enough of the body that we can... Give her physical proof up, as opposed to radioactive ashes. Maybe not use the hostile elemental destructions that you prefer. Yes, but this is the perfect time for a nuke. No, you can hold a nuke. I did it! Esther. I figured out how it's done! You're right. This... Where did my bag go? Time to unleash no. the ultimate in free love. That which loves all indiscriminately. Death. And proceeds to take and break down all organic matter into the simplest of hydrocarbons, releasing hydrocarbons and oxygen everywhere. Again, you're using a lot of science, not a lot of fairy. She doesn't care if he uses science or fairy. She just wants their fucking head so that the Winter Court knows not to fucking do this shit anymore. So, in other yes. words, in other words, you just need to kill a bunch of people. Not a bunch. All of them. No, well, I think she unfortunately, this is Mira's people. How is she going to like this? Not at all. Spiral damage? Can't my problem. Well, here, here's here's two options. 
one we can we can inform you in he ahead of time and tell you to um and tell you that to try to cover. convince them to pull uh, to pull back or two you can sit on the sidelines and not do a thing mm -hmm. Yeah, Mira, you're at a fucking crossroads if they tell you because if they tell if they tell you, yeah, no, this counts towards your pledge of have not fucking over your court. Yeah, I would tell them. Me would personally, I'm doing my thing and I'm not really involved. I'm just doing my, uh, you know, investigation. By, by the way, um, by the way, a um. I'm just half tempted to say my character sends you a uh, a welcome to the team gift basket. What does that entail? Muffins and crackers? Muffins, crackers, and lots and lots of expensive sake. Lots of expensive alcohol, of course. The best way to make friends. Alcohol. Oh, best, way. best way. <clears throat> Also a pistol with wooden stake bullets. My character mails you a one-year membership to the best damn brothel in uh, the state. A.K.A. And your then, brothel. Yes. And, and he walks in only to see a where, and only to see me and me and my and in, in my yeah werewolf form just dancing on a pole. No, that's in the back room. Yeah, you kind of call it lunacy, and that's bad for business. Hey, it's furry night. No, no, it's just, that, that's for the supernatural clientele that you strip for, then in your werewolf form. Devin, let's be honest. Does my character and my character really just breaks the wall between the supernatural and the natural? My character really probably doesn't give a shit. Mara, so the Winter Court tell calls. Hello. Yeah, there's some. So the summer court has an, someone working in their employ who is really, really getting close to basically making it so big that the supernatural is out there. And as you know, they dream. <laughs> and as you know, when mortals dream of the strange, the true fae might find it. The true fae find it, the true fae will come. So, kill Deal with the problem however you see fit. Okay. <laughs> so, in other words, I'm the problem. Yep. Hey, babe! Oh, we haven't even dealt with the fact of the mass ecological disaster that you caused, and what the fuck is, uh... And I don't even think anyone even knows uh, knows who that was is the better thing. Actually, I got to thinking the um, dose of lasagamide my character threw out. Because that stuff doesn't really degrade. It just tends to spread. And mm -hmm. <clears throat> exactly what an effective dose is. Well, sorry, exactly how little it takes for an effective dose. I hope that I didn't get... I'm not going to get sick from there being ants swimming in something I was drinking. No, um, you... Uh, I'll down some alcohol. It'll be fine. <laughs> well, no. here, here, here's it's what fun. you do. You don't drink it. <clears throat> no, you add 10% whiskey, at which point it becomes sterile. Then you add 60% whiskey, at which point it starts tasting about right. Then, after you finish that drink, you pour straight whiskey and you say the fuck with the ants. By that point, you don't really care about the ants anymore, either. Pretty much. Or you just pour in chocolate syrup and it becomes a delicacy. <laughs> so, I, I, I got sent up to Ben. You, you, you need to, you, they want you to either convince Ben to stop Publicly, they don't give a shit. They're more pissed off at the fact that the summer court is yet again basically going, Supernatural is here! Come get us, motherfuckers! What's even better is I'm not part of the summer court. They must go, so there's a werewolf in, there's a werewolf in town, the only werewolf. There's a werewolf in town that is effectively saying fuck and 
fuck the barrier between natural and supernatural. You need to make them stop so that the true fate will come. Then you, you you need to you need to stop doing that. So the true fate don't come. I hate to be I hate to be honest here, but uh, aren't they already coming for us? Yeah, yeah. they're already kind of gunning for us. Yeah, well, that's but that's not they, the they're, point. there's there's no that's that's not the point. The well, needs of the few versus the needs of the many. There's a lot more than just us. Yeah, and we're the only ones that are really somewhat safe. And that's... No, yeah. they're somewhat safe. You, my friend. Oh, yeah, yeah. Fuck. Man, I, uh, if I get word of this shit, I'm just gonna ghost. You're gonna ghost. Um, but yeah, so... In, in, w wouldn't it be easier if we were to just, you know... Get them to and get them to come sooner rather than later, so we don't have to sit here and sit here all scared and scared out of our minds. No, because that wouldn't fix anything. You kill them, fuck their titles. Do you know how hard it is to kill a true fae? Um, you just kill it over and over and over and over and over. We've tried Start it before. Start off by murder fucking it. Found... And you fucking it, it hasn't worked. The the last time one one was introduced to some uh, to uh to our summer court friend, they suffered the fate of the of everything else that faces love and compassion. Actually, I believe that one became splatters. No, that yeah, one that one, did that one, that one did no splatters. that no that one became a prop and then proceeded to fuck you all over later. Oh fuck. This is sword one we were talking about, or yeah. is this a different one? No, this is the um, lady of the eternal, the, the um, empress of eternal love and pat compact. You know, the one that the fire chick that one. Oh, the lighter. Face the lighter. Fine, I fine, I turn, I I promise to tone it down. Huzzah! Okay, that works. I'll only do it at furry conventions where pe where people will just think it's a fur suit. I don't. Or think you even just then. go to the back room. And do special supernatural. Or just yeah, show. just just stop, stop doing shit for general pop for the general population. Do private shit for people who are already in the know for the supernatural. Or I shoot you. Or I rip your legs off and bury you in concrete. But I kind of like his organs first before you bury him <laughs> in concrete. Oh, James, Jesus, fuck! Where did you come from? <laughs> Wait, are you watching me strip dance? I am almost everywhere. I am doing science <laughs> for the name of science with sciencey stuff. Oh my god, that means you watch me and bow my sugar daddy. <laughs> <laughs> it is very good research, unfortunately. <laughs> I guess it also makes for good bat material. Here's uh, here's the recordings, by the way. God fucking damn it, guys. I mean recording. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I have notes. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, he's recorded having so oh god. This is, oh my I don't put I don't post it on the internet. Yes. I post Network Zero post. will fuck your but yeah, keep telling yourself that. It's not like Network Zero can fucking find your shit or any no way. So as long so as it doesn't touch the internet. So effectively all that would happen is one day if I, if 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 we're like Fuck it, we need to get the fucking uh, and the fucking uh, true fay here. I just post my porn on the network zero. I don't think that's how that works. <laughs> Actually, do the true fay even have internets or are they Wi Fi less? Uh, if you have the archive merit, uh, you can sort of get an internet. No, it's glamour powered. True well, fae, he, he, no, true fae, um, go through dreams. So basically, if, and, some, and, if, if people are dreaming about it, then true fae can locate things. And effectively, what will end up happening is they'll locate a they'll, 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 uh, all over the internet just goes a fucking werewolf porn. Ooh. I guarantee you that we'll just draw true fae out almost immediately. No, that'll draw out uh, the hunters trying to figure out why there's werewolf porn. 
and then the SCP organization is going to come in trying to figure out why there's werewolf porn. <laughs> and then the FBI, the CIA, the MSNBC, <laughs> CNN, maybe AP, then the true SFI. fails. Maybe then the true fails show up. But at that point, they're just kidnapping a bunch of people and turning them into wolves. Wait, seriously? That's how it works? They're they just go, I want... Oh, so you like wolves, don't you? Yeah. Yoink! You are now a wolf. You know, actually, I wouldn't mind playing a changeling next game. <sighs> yeah, speed the abuse victim, Ben. Be the abuse victim. I'm totally I'm not going to be a little girl. Changeling. Make other people into changelings and become a true fey himself or something evil. I'm totally not going to be. Isn't I'm that totally one of your plans be to girl. become a true fey? Who, me or him? One of your you. plans, somebody's plan was to become a true fey at one point in this game. Yes, has to fuck the world until I got some. Room. I was offered to become a true fey. Yes, but you turned it down because then you'd become a horrible, abusive monster like your paper. What's wrong with that? <laughs> Unlike, is it is it, um, is it sad I'm now actually kind of hoping I die, and that this character dies so I can just be a changeling? <laughs> yeah. Doing okay? I'm just gonna play this character until it either dies or there's no reason for me, for it to be played, or it's too dangerous for it to be played. Like I said, when I'm done here, I'll go have a witch in. <laughs> anyway, so anything interesting happened, Devin? Let me think, let me think, with my slightly alcohol-addled mind. Yeah, for now. Actually, right now, and actually soon might be a good time for my character to, uh, to just vanish off into the wilderness again. Why? Because we have someone currently trying to chase him down. You know, if you vanish now, that'll be suspicious. Good point. My char my character would effectively I uh, would effectively just chill I uh, would would effectively just deal with moving into the city with a slasher uh daddy. God damn it, Van, are you switching characters like a month before the game ends? Technically eh. I did. I started this trend. We're not switching party members. It's gonna happen eventually, Devin. I, I wanna be a dragon. Are. I'm going to literally murder all of you. You know, Devin. I hope that's the plan. Hey, Devin. Just as a warning, it, it is getting close to my bedtime. I know, so we will be wrapping up shortly. Wow, nothing really, tra nothing really progressed this session. Did role you expect us? Role playing <laughs> stuff happened, and actually, a lot of stuff happens. Um, let's recap. Let's see. I was promoted, and I got to sign a a thingy that said we're, we're going to make a new lab under a hospital, and I get to have an asylum as a basement fun house. I'm going to probably hire an Igor, and I have a sexiest, or I have a sexier, I have a secretary who is attractive. Let's and see. Um, on that secretary. Godness character has learned that the culprit of his murder, death, whatever, was by the hands of someone who can go invisible, which is a still quite the shoebox-sized laundry list of characters who could do that. When he when he narrows it down to when he narrows it down to uh and to where and to werewolf and something else, then my character will vanish. No, it's not werewolf or something else. Werewolves can't turn invisible. Yeah, magic exactly. items can turn werewolves well, invisible, but I'm he has to narrow kind of, down magic. He knows items. I he knows I can. I am still kind of annoyed that I got two exceptionals in a row, and uh, I got really fuck all from it. Well, to be fair, there's basically True. there's basically almost no information about yeah, it. Yeah, there's basically no information on the internet because most organizations make sure that there isn't anything on the internet about it. You might as well just start hacking into organizations then. God like, no, with literally, the changelings make sure that most changeling shit doesn't get on the internet. I mean, for crying out loud, in most changeling games, like, I'm sorry... This summer court is really fucking lax because they basically own the criminal element and they're the fucking rulers of the city. Hmm? Otherwise, if there was like a police officer, what? For a bitch. If there was like, if there were cops that were like changelings, like no, there would be a completely different fucking story because they'd be covering this shit up like no one's fucking business. And let's see. Then when we go to the changeling side of thing, because Ben. 
Short of Ven trying not to get shot by Godness character for killing him on accident, though intentionally, we have the changelings who are going to be at odds with each other because changeling A, Haskell, and the Summer Court are I might not happy go... with changeling B and Spectre, the Winter Court. Because care... Winter Court is wave, waving their uh, phallus around, and Summer Court is a little hurt. <clears throat> We're Actually, my character butthurt. might join the Summer Court. We're a lot butthurt, thank you. And the way we celebrate being properly fucking butthurt is we buttfuck the shit out of everyone else until we're no longer butthurt. <laughs> that sounds like a plan. And we're gonna murder fuck the shit out <laughs> of them. And then we're gonna... Then, murder I don't the know, man. You might be right. The game might be coming to a close soon at this rate. Yeah, because we're because we're kind of just slow, st- un, just slow. Like we run, we run out of things to do. You kind of run out run out of things to get, to give us. If I'm if going you tell insane. if you tell God if you t- a ghost. if you tell a few of us to um to change characters or if I, or if I were to change character and have a ma- and have a major plot point or something involving well, the Trufe, have, then yeah. You do have the whole thing of uh. The, the creatures. Oh, uh, oh yeah, we will do that as a cliffhanger. Um, as a cliffhanger, this then the spirits are uneasy. Motherfucker. Other cha- they will tell you other cha- shape changers have come into the into the area seeking vengeance for the ecological disaster. Or what? Of course, it's mostly the death spirits because the death spirits fucking love you right now. They want you. They the, these creatures. These they want me to survive because no, no, I because yeah. I bring death because everywhere I go there's death. Also, that you're a good. Also, you've been a fairly relaxed enforcer of the laws. You basically let them do whatever the fuck they want, and as long as they don't go too extreme. You're, yeah, as long as you're... as long as long as actually, I, I, that's that's me for all the spirits. As long as they don't go too yes, extreme, uh, yes, I allow. Spirit, so, yeah, at, you're as close to you're like as close to a pure as many people or as many wolves werewolves could get, and like they like you, so they're telling you that there's something coming into the area. That's there, there's a cr- group coming into the of of uh, shapeshifter changers coming into the area. Seeking out the one who caused the ecological disaster. Ecological disaster being the... The power plant. Okay. However, one of their numbers has already fallen. James. Yes. Uh, you receive uh, in a small vanilla envelope at your house a flash drive. Okay. I will obviously put it into a computer and then consider eating it. Uh, there are several photos on there of, uh, of not a crime scene, of a future crime scene, i.e. one that hasn't been discovered yet. Okay. Of some humanoid. Or of basically there's a video of, um, of um, someone's hand in a, with a scalpel basically... Sneaking up behind someone, them turning into a anthropomorphic werebore, and then him and then the hand proceeding to make gouges in their in their art major art all their major arteries with a silver scalpel. Okay. Uh, and then photos of afterwards of the body set up in a, on like the bed in a particular way. Of what you would recognize as operating standards, yes, um, with various organs and whatnot removed. Um, hang on, he's going to. Uh... You know what? Next session, we'll ro- we'll make the rolls because uh, Doctor Walker's trying to teach you something. Ooh. And with that, we'll call it for the night. Okay. Good night. Thanks for playing and watching. Just a bit chaotic.